in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen my dear brother and sister fraternal greetings to you from the carmelite fathers and warm welcome to carmel light a reflection on the day's readings it's the 20th of february tuesday of the first week of lent and today we remember saint jacinta and saint francisco marto these are the visionaries of the apparitions of our lady of fatima and today we remember world day of social justice with these thoughts let's pay attention to the scripture reading of the day a reading from the book of prophet isaiah chapter 55 verses 10 to 11 thus says the lord as the rain and the snow come down from heaven and do not return there but water the earth making it bring forth and sprout giving seed to the sower and bread to the eater so shall my word be that goes out from my mouth it shall not return to be empty but it shall accomplish that which i purpose and shall succeed in the thing for which i sent it the word of the lord thanks be to god brothers and sisters for thousands of years politicians and merchants have made claims about what they or their products can do and some of us have learned that more than a few of these claims are wildly exaggerated not so with god he tells us that his word goes out and never fails to accomplish his will and he is absolutely right think about the word that proceeds from god's mouth the word is creative read the first chapter of genesis when god said let there be light there was light so too with day and night earth and sea plants and animals and all the rest all things saint john says came to be through that word when a word goes forth from god's mouth it brings into being something that never was life it establishes in you what is lacking so that his life in you can flourish so that your faith and your relationships can deepen the word is authoritative that might suggest notions of governments commands and obedience but authority also means trusted true reliable and dependable this is who god is and he is for you when he commands he also offers the grace to obey your obedience to him brings you life because in everything he works for the good with us his authoritative word never changes or varies 
it never deceives or manipulates it just is solid true dependable and trustworthy the word is near to you this creative word which you can rely on and trust and which surpasses everything is as near as the tongue in your mouth as close as the heart in your chest you long for life or peace joy or patience and the word which is close to you can bring them about in you ask god for what you lack healing forgiveness a new start or a permanent break with old habits he will speak the word you need and as you take it up it will accomplish his desires for you the word is alive jesus the word of god became flesh dwelt among us and overcame even death itself nothing can conquer him so rejoice in god's word today read it seek its guidance invite it into your life and watch it bear fruit father speak your word to me today i long to be made alive with you amen brothers and sisters in our psalm we hear that not only does god speak and things happen but god also listens particularly to the afflicted and the poor and god's listening also leads to action for god responds by ministering to those who call out let's pray that psalm now your response the lord rescues them in all their distress the lord rescues them in all their distress glorify the lord with me together let us praise his name i sought the lord and he answered me from all my terrors he set me free the lord rescues them in all their distress look toward him and be radiant let your faces not be abashed this lowly one called the lord heard and rescued him from all his distress the lord rescues them in all their distress the lord turns his eyes to the just and his ears are open to their cry the lord turns his face against the wicked to destroy their remembrance from the earth the lord rescues them in all their distress when the just cry out the lord hears and rescues them in all their distress the lord is close to the broken hearted those whose spirit is crushed he will save the lord rescues them in all their distress glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end amen pray for god's blessing now May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Brothers and sisters, we remember today all those who are celebrating their birthday, especially Brother Ryan Prem Fernandez Carmelite, Kaylin Pinto from Kuwait, Kanchan Tudu, and Calvin Wilfred De Souza from Badkal Bailo. Wish you all a happy birthday. God bless you. Peter and Ludi Rebello from Dubai are celebrating their wedding anniversary today. Congratulations dear friends. May God bless your family life. And 
we pray for the departed soul of Louis Joseph Rego from Wamanjur, Mangalore. May the Lord grant him eternal rest. That's all for today, my dear friends. Have a great day. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.